Hello and welcome. My name is Divya. Now today we expose the murky connections between the Congress party and illegal Rohingya migrants in Haryana's Nu district. Our investigation reveals how Congress is allegedly using these outsiders as a vote bank with startling links between the communal unrest and the party's victory. Now Maman Khan, a Congress candidate, secured a landslide victory in the Jhirka Assembly seat of Nu, winning by a massive 98,441 votes in the recent concluded assembly elections. But beneath this triumph lies a controversy. Khan, currently facing charges under the UAPA, is accused of inciting communal violence in Nu on 31st of July 2023. While Khan's victory enjoys strong local support, reports suggest that illegal Rohingya migrants also played a crucial role. Nu, with an 80% Muslim population, is experiencing demographic changes largely due to influx of these illegal migrants. A video shows a madarsa in Nu catering to illegal Rohingya immigrants. Now children here are heard saying non-believers will burn in hell, raising alarming concerns over radicalization. Now teachers in this madarsa proudly admit that they are Rohingyas from Myanmar living illegally in Nu without fear or repercussions. In an on-camera confession, one Rohingya refugee openly admitted to crossing into India illegally from Bangladesh in 2016. My name is Ziaur Rahman. Ziaur Rahman. Where are you from? Yes, I live in Nuhu. I live here for children. Are you here for years? Yes, I live here for 3 years. I live here for 2016. Then I live here for... مدرسہ میں سنگی کی وجہ سے بند پڑا ہو کچھ دن پھر چالو کیا تین چار سال ہو رہا باہر لوگ بتا رہے ہیں کہ یہاں روہنگا مسلم اس کے بچے زیادہ پڑھتے ہیں برما سے بھی لوگ آئے ہوئے ہیں آپ یہی کے ہیں یا آپ باہر سے آئے ہوئے ہیں برما کے ہوں جی آپ برما سے آئے ہیں یہاں پر کوئی ڈاکیمنٹ آدھار کچھ بنا کچھ نہیں ہے جی بس جی پوجی کارڈ ہے یہاں پر یہ آپ لوگوں نے خود ہی بنایا سرکار کی کوئی مدد ہے یہ مد ना कोई मदद नहीं पर कोई रोक टोक तो नहीं है सरकार आती कहीं भी रेड किया बोल दिया कि बंद कर दो ऐसा तो नहीं हुआ ना ना ऐसा ही नहीं हुआ लेकिन ऐसा ही है सेफ्टी हिसाब से चलाने के लिए कहेगा He confirmed having no passport or visa, relying solely on a UNHCR card. Now this raises serious questions about Congress's role in turning a blind eye to the presence of these illegal migrants. The Congress party now faces tough questions. Are they deliberately using illegal Rohingyas as a vote bank in Nome? Why is the party backing those who shelter these outsiders? Can Congress explain their role in Maman Khan's victory or the communal unrest that followed? As these connections between the Congress and illegal Rohingya migrants come to light, we will continue to investigate the party's involvement in fueling anti-India sentiments. How long will Congress support this dangerous game? Stay tuned as the story unfolds. Don't miss out. Log on to oneindia.com for more updates.